G'day mates. I put up a poll concerning what I should talk about and HHOC said one. This video was going to be about the storyline, but I had fucked it up with the script. So I'm going to be talking about what my inspiration was with the designs of the main cast. Midnight, Amunet, Jack, Robbie, or Nell Rosa, and Hope. Midnight, the paralysis skeleton demon. It's originally created on July 10th in the HHOC universe, but it was first thought of on November 4th when it was meant for another project that didn't go well. Anyways, over the train wreck that was 2020, my characters from a successful project, Elemental Quest, the more changes I designed for one, I was able to benefit the other with similar features. Amunet, the Shadow Cat Demon. She was created on April 10th, but similar to Midnight, she was based off of something else I'd created, Pharaoh, or is now on the screen. If it isn't obvious, she's from the Egyptian era, which is why I originally had her wearing bandages and a pharaoh-like mask. Jack, the Flaming Pumpkin Demon. Jack's design was actually based off of the shit show that is Teen Titans Go. Now you're thinking, Teen Titans Go? Really? Well, it's not the show in general, it's the Halloween episode shown with the Halloween spirit summoned by Raven. Over time, I'd redesigned and matched the era when he was born. Robbie slash Rosa, the spider demon. I won't lie, Robbie was just a complete rip-off of Hasmund Arachnus. But over time, I'd actually lost the ability to draw him. Until drawing the gender-bent versions of them, in which Rosa was born. Now, I'd matched her clothes from Robbie, but had her hair more unique from Arachnus. Finally, Hope, the Lamp Demon. Hope's design was actually from a Make a Demon OC thing that I thought would be fun. But with my drawing skills, it, it, it was terrible. Just it came out poorly. But Carl and Eastley, or the Villager King, had asked if he could take a crack at it. And it actually turned out amazing. I haven't made changes to her, but just like Al's monocle, I will forget to draw her freckles on occasions. Anyway, Happy New Year! I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Now, I have no excuse for almost taking three weeks to upload something, but I am also working on a Best of 2020 video slash Evolution of My Art Part 2. I also plan to release more videos with my voice. For now, I will allow my Twitter followers to pick the video ideas.